Oh, darn it. I wish first off that I had uh, my batteries charged for the camcorder so that way I, w I could keep it stable. I don't want to bring the gantry down and so on and so forth and whatever. Um, but what I'm trying to do right now is, um, I don't know if you want to call it experiment or um, whatever, but I'm trying to get into that whole thing of uh, layering of command structure for me and whatnot. So... Um, Hold on, I just got to turn down the music just a little bit. I forgot that I had pumped it up. Yeah, sorry about that. I was listening to some Bruckner and uh, it I forgot I was listening to something else previous and its recording level was different. Now it's like kaboom. Anyways, so what I've decided to do, um, I don't know if you remember, but so this, like this whole thing, at least in my world, I'm calling this a theater. So this is the Eastern Theater. And this part here is the um, Galicia sector for the Eastern Theater. And in my thing for part of the Katowice uh, conference agreement here, uh, anything um, west of the Visloka here is under German control. So any even the Austrian um, troops and whatnot are all under um, German control. And anything east of the Visloka is under Austrian control. And the sector commander for this is the newly appointed, uh, newly promoted, because he only used to be a corps commander at, at this point in the, in the juncture in time, uh, Svetozar Brejevich von Bonja. And so he's in Shemish. And the way I'm doing it is he's basically just giving out general orders to the army commanders. Um uh, von Brudermann over here in Third Army, this guy here, and uh, I don't do the. Fr I can't remember the first and fourth. I'll have to go and look them up. Don't oh, no. Let's not go down that road, Chris. Just wait. I'm, I'm only s s uh, sitting here. These are my first bits of general orders. But anyways, when they send out the general, uh, he sends out the general orders. It's going to be no micromanaging. It's just going to be bas basically. This is what I want done. You just you figure it out. And uh, uh, so Berevich is going to be basically, um, uh, you know, orchestrating the flow of supply and reinforcements and stuff like that. And like I said, the general orders. And one of his main thing is going to be, and I'm like, yeah, right on, man. He's uh, like newly promoted, new, uh, you know, a, a change of pace, the whole nine yards. And one of the things he's going to do is reinstate uh, this guy here, uh, Edward von um, Baum Ermoli, that guy there. He's going to reinstate him to field uh, status as a general because uh, what had ended up happening way back when was that uh, the Second Army got completely crushed by Bruce Brusilov. He basically didn't have an army left, so I, I was like, well, I'll put you to desk duty kind of thing, and you can direct stuff in Shemish, and then your remaining troops I'll give to um, von Brudermann in the Third Army. But things have changed so much that now I'm like, you know what, I really would like to have an extra army HQ here. So I'm going to break up. So our, uh, the second army, there'll be a newly up, newly formed bit, I, I newly con reconstituted or whatever you want to call it. I don't know who's going to be in it yet, but like I said, I'm just starting for crying out loud. And then uh, that way, you know, the poor guy anyways, Von Bruderman's been doing such a freaking good job. And then he can deal with just that bit and then I can uh, have that bit and then go there. And so the next layer, once I finish dealing with Berevich, will be, okay, Go off to each army uh, commander and then they'll have their own core commanders and so on and so forth and I'm gonna go from there to there to there and we'll see it's like I said just an experiment type of a thing I'm I'm loving the hell out of it I can tell you that much that's it um, yeah all right see you later hope you're having a good time bye